In today's video, I'm going to be going over how to actually get the six pack abs, especially for skinny fat guys who are struggling to cut down their belly fat. But first, who am I? For all the new viewers, what's up? My name is Igor. A few years ago, I was super unhappy with how my body looked. I had a layer of fat covering my stomach and I wanted to change it. So I went on a journey, watched every tutorial out there, tried every diet and finally achieved the abs. So in this video, I want to show you exactly what I did so you can hopefully achieve this look too. Hope this helps. Now, I'm gonna split this video up into three sections. Number one, we have diet. Number two, your training. And number three, other. So let's begin with the video. So section one, diet. Now I'm gonna keep this video as simple as possible. Therefore, I'm just gonna give you all of the straight facts. The reason you can't see abs right now is because there's a layer of fat covering your stomach. Therefore, we need to get rid of this fat, meaning we need to change our diet and modify our diet and get into a consistent caloric deficit. In simpler terms, you just need to stop eating crap, bro. Most guys our age are eating KFC, junk food, drinking energy drinks. And do you know how many calories is in that, bro? It's literally the reason why you don't have abs. And I get it, it's hard to eliminate these foods. Therefore, an easier way to do this is to just find alternatives to these foods, healthy alternatives. For example, you can replace chips with carrot slices or sweets with fruits or soft drinks with juice or even milk with stuff like almond milk and oat milk. This worked for me. And the general rule of thumb is that you want to feel a little bit hungry all the time. If you're feeling a little bit hungry, I'm not telling you to starve yourself. Don't do this because at this age, we want to grow. And therefore, if you're not eating at all and you're dieting all day and intermittent fasting, you're probably going to be losing a lot of weight and stunting your growth, which is just not worth it. So I recommend you eat healthy, bro eat quite a bit eat a few times a day but make sure you feel just a little bit hungry so make sure to reduce your portion sizes but make sure you're getting all of your nutrients in but just remember to not starve yourself a lot of people fall into this trap of dieting doing this extreme diets and guess what bro maybe they get abs but guess what it impacts their health poorly and this is what i actually did i did this thing where i wouldn't eat all day because i wanted abs so bad i would literally not eat i'll eat one meal a day and all i would eat throughout the day was just a few nuts and therefore i did get abs but guess what man it could have stunted my growth therefore i would not recommend this so make sure you're eating a lot of meals throughout the day. Just replace unhealthy foods with healthier alternatives. And this is how you're going to start to slowly reveal your abs. The saying that abs are made in the kitchen is absolutely true. Therefore, start eating healthy. It's really as simple as that. I know you didn't want to hear this, but this is the straight fact. All right, number two, your training. Now, this is the part where 90% of teenagers go wrong. Most guys think that you need to do these five minute ab workouts online that you see these douchebag YouTubers posting. Trust me, bro, these are a scam. These are not gonna get you abs. To get abs, again, you need to change your diet, but most guys don't realize that by literally just working out at the gym consistently, maybe three times a week or more, you're literally gonna be improving your abs just by doing all these compound lifts, like deadlifts, bench press, calisthenics, whatever you're doing, your abs are gonna start to pop out over time if you combine that with a healthy diet as well. And doing resistance training will also help you maintain your muscle because when we start to get abs and start to lose fat we might be losing our muscle therefore by training and eating well you're still going to be upkeeping your muscle so you can remain you know looking aesthetic and stuff but then again if you do want your abs to really pop so you can get that greek physique you know what i'm saying you need to do a few ab exercises per week i literally recommend only two exercises number one is hanging leg raises this was a great exercise this works the lower abs and therefore it gives you the full six pack this is literally the only ab exercise I did back in the day and it got me abs really quick. I even added some weights to it because most guys don't realize your abs are a muscle and you need to train it. Sure, you can lose the body fat and you'll see the abs, but you know those skinny people that just have no body fat and you can't really see their abs because they don't look that good. Therefore, by training your abs, they'll start to pop out a bit more because it's literally just like a muscle. You need to train your abs to get them to pop. Therefore, pick a few exercises to do throughout your week. Do them a few times a week and I promise you that your abs are going to start to look better. But again, I recommend hanging leg raises and some sort of training for your weeks as well just so they can pop out too and i'll also recommend you do a little bit of cardio throughout your week as well because we are trying to lose fat so doing cardio will definitely help do that for example running on a treadmill walking uphill, doing HIIT training, doing kettlebell training, any kind of activity that's gonna burn a lot of calories, I recommend you do, maybe even cycling, bro. This will help you, and during your sleep, you're also gonna burn a lot more calories while you're sleeping. But anyways, that's it for training. It's literally as simple as that. Getting abs, it's so simple, man. Most people don't realize this. But training in the gym is nowhere near as important as you think when it comes to building the abs. You don't need to train your abs directly that much. Just make sure you're working out, doing the compound lifts, and over time, combined with a good diet, your abs will pop out.
And as for the section for other, I'm going to mention a bunch of things that you need to take care of. You need to make sure you're doing these things to get apps. If you don't do these things, you're not going to see apps. This is one of the most important sections of the video. So number one, you need to get your steps in, bro. This is such an easy way to get abs and this does fall under the category of cardio, but you need to just be walking around more, bro. Try and go out on walks in the park. Just try and get your body moving. This is how you get more calories burnt and over time, you will start to see abs if you continue to just be more physically active. Also, this is a very important one. Make sure to drink a bunch of water. If you're not hydrated, you're not going to see abs, bro. What I recommend doing is getting a water bottle, getting a nice water bottle, like a quality one, like a Yeti or something. Carry that around everywhere you go and make sure to always drink a little bit of water. This will not only reduce your headache, but it'll also help you burn fat. Water is the number one liquid for removing fat from your body. So make sure you're drinking a bunch of water. And number three, the most important one, prioritize your sleep, bro. Teenagers need to get at least eight to nine hours of sleep per night. I don't care what anyone says. If you're training your abs, doing all of this, but you're not getting adequate sleep, you're not going to see good results. Therefore, try and have a comfortable sleeping environment. Go outside, set your circadian rhythm, eat healthy foods, avoid eating and drinking before bed. And I promise you, bro, your sleep is going to improve. So it's really important that you do that. But that's it for this video, man. Getting abs is really as simple as you think. And if you need more help with that, book a call with me in the description, comment down below, and I'll help you out as much as possible. But if you want to see more guides like this in the future, let me know, and I'll see you in the next video. Пока, брат.